application. When the government is not reliable, you cannot, uh, you know, like wait things from uh, from that. You have to keep your problems by yourself. And the point is that with the families we have here, which are homelesses, we can't just like watch them dying, and uh, we have to do something. But because the government uh, is not doing that, we decided to uh, to do it here to put. Uh, our families in a, in security, in a safe place. People uh, uh, that are part of the association here occupy this gymnasium for like the past two weeks, and uh, the people about 150 families that are either homeless, also with kids as you can see, that are either homeless or. Uh, housed in hotels by emergency services or that are very badly housed like uh, indigenous buildings I don't know if you say so so we keep up the, the occupation until the state takes on its responsibilities and uh, and we house those the people that are occupying the gym now so the people who own the gym are, are help, happy are letting you uh, sorry the people who own the gym are letting you use it's the, gym. the it's the town so hall that uh, oh, the it's it's property the, of the, owns it, so the, the the city of paris <laughs> owns it so at the beginning they said we leave you until the we find the solution and the state finds a solution now that the pressure is starting for us to leave but we won't leave because we don't have a solution so we keep all right so you're not going to leave until there's a place to for people to live. yes for the 150 families who occupy here and among them 35 families uh, including 20 children uh, have absolutely nowhere to go not even housed in hotels or anything they have they're homeless so we are uh, occupying this uh, this place for uh, two weeks now because a lot of our people in uh, Didal, uh, Droit au Logement, is uh, not supported by uh, the government. And as you can see be behind myself, uh, the 115 is the uh, number uh, to, uh, to get uh, an emergency accommodation. The point is that it's not reliable. You cannot, uh, you cannot find any place with this, uh, with, with, this, uh, with this number. There is a lot of money in this neighborhood. There is also the presidential palace next to us. So uh, yeah, it, it's also a signal from us. You know, like, uh, hey, it's in front of you. You have to react and uh, you have to, uh, to enforce the law. You have to uh, provide security to, uh, to these people. And you have to make a huge social measures in order to eradicate the poverty and uh, bad housing. We've received some threats yesterday uh, from, the, uh, from the authorities, uh -huh. but we don't have any solution. Like, they are not proposing us any solution for the people which are homeless and we, uh, which are, are defended by, by us. Uh, so, until there is no solution for these people, we cannot come back to the streets. Macron promised us to, uh, to, sh to, to, to shelter uh, people already two years ago. Now the situation is totally the same. So we, we demand to the, uh, to the president of France to uh, keep its promises and to uh, find solutions for the, the, uh, the families which are actually homeless without any solution. Everybody out! France is bad! Macron is bad! 
and social housing. Solidarité avec les allongés.